guys, it's Kenya here, and today is January 10th, 2022. Um, I do wanna tell you guys, happy belated new year. Um, I know I've been missing in action for a while, however, uh, I really don't have an excuse. I've been lazy, 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 lazy. But since I have some free time on my hand, um, I am going to also be doing a what do I eat in a day video and I will also be this video will come out first okay all right so let's go ahead and get into my stats so I started my journey on April 5th 2021 I started my journey at 325 pounds as of today I weighed in this morning, which is January 10th, 2022. I weighed in at 208 pounds, bringing me to a 100 and 117 pound weight loss. Um, let's see here. So I did go ahead and set a goal for myself. Um, since that I'm coming close to uh, my one year mark in a few months. Um, so I did go ahead and set my goal at 175. Um, you know, it's gonna take a lot of work. I'm gonna need to push myself because I really haven't been pushing myself lately. Um, I haven't been working out as I should. Um, and let's go ahead and talk about how things have been going with me. So um, I'm back to uh, taking my regular uh, multivitamin here. I don't have to uh, take in addition to's anymore um, since my levels are back to normal, but uh, the only thing that I want to say is that um, make sure that you guys are taking your vitamins. They're very, very important. Um, also, if one, if one vitamin doesn't work for you, try another. They have so many different brands and types out there. So definitely look into it. I did, you know, struggle with that in the beginning where I did buy uh, chewable tablets and those weren't for me. Um, they're still sitting uh, on my dresser. I don't know, I probably should just toss them out. Um, let's see. Uh, also, my water intake. So, it's still the same. It's a hit or miss um, with me getting to my 64 ounce. Um, typically, what I try to do is uh, I have about two of these a day. Um, I try to at least drink it about halfway before I put like any kind of um, crystal lights or anything in it. Um, my favorite is this one, which is the iced tea. Um, this is my favorite. Uh, so I usually have about one of these a day. Um, and that does help me with my water intake. Um, I noticed, uh, I think it was about three weeks ago, I was lacking on my water and it was giving me a dry throat. Um, so I try to tell you, and heartburn. So make sure that you are keeping up on your water intake. It's very, very important. Um, I, don't, I can't stress that enough. Um, I've also uh, have taken um, walks in the morning you know, taking my dogs for walks in the morning at the park. Um, that is also beneficial. Um, as long as you just keep yourself moving, um, even if you're not going to the gym, try to incorporate something, move around furniture in the house, um, try to, uh, you know, clean up, keep active in any way that you can. Um, I know I haven't lost a significant amount of weight from my last video. Um, I have been doing um, a little bit of weights. I have increased my weight because um, I'm noticing that uh, this right here, this is not cute. No, this is not cute. We don't want this, you know? This, you gotta go bye-bye. <laughs> but it's, it's important to work out. 
Um, I'm also doing some workout videos at home, um, you know, to help out those who can't go to the gym for whatever reason, if it's, you know, because of what's going on in the world today and you choose not to go out, you know, there are things that you can do at home. So I am doing uh, at home workout videos and I am putting them up on my Instagram. So definitely check those out. Uh, also, if you wanna write me directly, you can send me an email. If you don't have social media, that's totally fine. Uh, let's see here. Um, my food intake. So my food intake has increased a little bit, not significant, but a little bit where I can take more than three bites of something. It depends on what it is. Um, shrimp, it's still, hmm, you know, probably before I think I was only able to eat one. Now I can eat two. Um, it also, well, no, those weren't really big shrimps, but but it never the case. It I only can do about two. I think it's because of the actual texture. Um, salads are a hit or miss. Some days it's really good. I think it depends on how the lettuce is cut up. Um, but always make sure if you're eating salads to have more meat than lettuce um, because of the protein, that's what you need. And I've also been dealing with constipation constipation so I think is because um there was a few days where I was skipping breakfast and taking a protein shake and the protein shakes affects me with constipation um and I would go probably a week at a time without having a bowel movement. So um, definitely keep that in mind when you're taking these protein. Too much protein does uh, affect you with constipation. Um, so I have been trying many different things to try to alleviate it. Marilax, um, different stool softeners, uh, herbal teas, um, uh, a number of things but I don't want to suggest anything on here because I am not a medical professional if you are dealing with constipation I suggest that you speak with your doctor um, and they can either suggest something to you or prescribe you with something um, because I know some of the things that I took you probably shouldn't be taking because uh, it may affect your stomach differently so definitely speak with your doctor okay um, this is just things that I did and I don't want to tell you exactly anything because I'm not a doctor. <laughs> oh man, me and my jokes today, but all jokes aside, um, definitely, 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 um, stay positive, stay motivated. Um, yes, I know sometimes we may have hiccups here and there, but it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Um, I was tough on myself for about a week because I got on the scale and I noticed that I gained four pounds. And I'm like, how? What did I do? But then I realized that I hadn't went to the bathroom in over a week. Um, and then I started to get a little bit of back pain. So I ended up taking something that brought me two pounds down. And then a few days later, I was back to where I was supposed to be. And I weighed in this morning. I'm at 208. Hopefully by my next video, I am under the 200 mark. That is a goal here. So definitely keep me accountable. Keep me accountable because I need it. But let's get into my thoughts and how I'm feeling. Enough with all my rambling. Let's get into my thoughts and how I'm feeling. So I am feeling so good. The reason I say that is because 
now I'm when I'm going out, I'm starting to put on heels. I'm starting to feel sexy. Uh, even though in the beginning I felt sexy, but I was always wearing flats because I wasn't comfortable in high heels anymore because I had gained so much weight. And now I'm going, I'm getting back to my old self. Like I am, the confidence is through the roof. Um, I will definitely insert some pictures so that you guys are able to see what I'm talking about. Like you can just see it in my face that I'm like, you bad, you know, but <laughs> listen, you have to, you have to, you have to stay positive on this journey. Um, it is super, 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 super hard um, for a lot of people. Um, what I, what I try is to stay motivated. Um, I have a lot of good support system around me, friends and family, even, um, people that I don't know in person, um, uh, meaning like people that I've met on social media, they always write me great words of encouragement that keeps me going. Um, it's hard to do it on your own. It's hard to do it on your own. I know it can be done, but it's hard. Um, it's great when you have some type of good support system around you. Um, so definitely keep that in mind, especially if you're thinking about going on the journey or if you're already on the journey. The people that keep you motivated, keep them around you. Keep them around you. Because um, the last thing you want to do is, you know, backtrack. And on another note, the thing that I hear a lot when um, people ask me, oh, Kenya, how did you lose the weight? What did you do? And when I tell them like, yeah, I had the gastric sleeve, I always hear, oh, I know someone that had it and they gained the weight back. Don't do that. That's very discouraging. Don't do that. There's a lot of success stories out there and I'm going to be one of them and you are too. So when you hear that, oh, I'm sorry, that was my phone. But when you hear that, let it go let it go you have to learn how to block that kind of energy and know that you will be a success story okay but definitely like comment and subscribe to my channel um if you haven't definitely subscribe it's free and until my next video love you guys and have a great one hi guys it's kenya here and today is december 28 2021 I'm here at the gym. I haven't been here in a minute, but let's go ahead and get this workout in. January 6, 2022, and I'm here working out from home. I will be doing upper body today, so let's go ahead and get into this workout. Today is Friday, January 7th, 2022. I'm here working out from home. 
This is a afternoon workout, so let's go ahead and get this workout in.